So, Rory, how are things at Chilton? Great. Great. Everything's great. And uh, Lorelei, things at the inn are good? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, Rory, mm -hmm. please slow down and chew your food properly. <laughs> I'm always telling her that. Pass the butter. Pass the peas. Pass the pork. Pass your plate. Uh, I'm sorry. Is there a race going on I don't know about? That was your mother, Richard. She just wanted to make sure that all our towels are Egyptian cotton. Well, it's a simple question. It's her 40th simple question of the day. Well, she's going to be staying with us, Emily. She just wants to know she'll be comfortable. Yes, because we usually give our guests the towels we've stolen from the Holiday Inn. Great grandma's coming to stay with you? Just for a few days, um, while her floors are being redone. So how's Grand doing? Yeah, does she miss London? Not half as much as I do. Emily? I've never really truly appreciated the Atlantic Ocean before. 3,000 lovely miles of water. You are talking about my mother. I know that, Richard. And I'm happy to have her stay here. But must she keep interrupting the one dinner a week that we have with with Lorelei and Rory. She knows what time we dine, and why are you two eating so quickly? We're not eating quickly. Yeah, you've been on the phone for a while. It probably just seems like we've eaten a lot. I wonder who that could be. Emily. Well, aren't we popular? Richard, perhaps you could get that while I have another bath sheet versus bath towel debate with your mother. You're giving it away. What? You're eating too quickly. What? You said we had to be out of here by 8.30. Yeah, but I didn't tell you to broadcast it. I'm eating at the same speed you are. But you're eating small bites very fast. you got to eat bigger bites at a normal speed. You mean I should risk choking so we can make our Friday night plans? Exactly. I apologize for that. Collection agency again? Excuse me? Thank goodness she called. Richard, did you know people actually expect there to be soap in their bathrooms when they... You got the front? Yeah. Why are there strange men hauling a mattress up my staircase? Well, now, Emily... She sent her own mattress? Well, she has a very sensitive back. She sent her own mattress? I'll go and supervise. <clears throat> well, Mom, looks like you got a lot going on here. With the mattresses and the phone calls. Yeah, so we're just gonna go and get out of your hair. Hold it right there. What is going on with you two? <laughs> Wait. What are you talking about? You know exactly what I'm talking about. Bolting down your food, leaving before dessert, Rory checking her pager every five minutes. What do you have planned? Fine. We'll just sit here until one of you feels like filling me in. She has a date. So does she. Yeah, but hers starts a half hour earlier than mine. Because you get to stay out later. Because I'm the mom. You two stop it right now. You're behaving like children. Sorry. Yeah, sorry. Our deal is for Friday night dinners, not appearances at Friday night dinners. Now you will sit there and you will eat your dessert. But I one more word and I throw in a game of charades. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Oh, we gotta get a faster car. Hey, don't blame the car. So you're saying it's my fault we're late? Well, who's the one who said, hey, I've got room for another piece of pie? Ah, you kept making all that pointless conversation, all those thank yous and pleases. What are you running for, Miss Congeniality? Just get ready. What time are you meeting, Jess? I don't know. I'll tell you in a sec. 